The meat processing industry has dominated national headlines lately. Now cattlemen are questioning whether antitrust laws were broken, claiming they've received less money for livestock, even as consumer demand remains strong. As the Montana Ag Network's Russell Nimitz tells us, President Trump is weighing in on the industry's concern. Well, as the spread between the price of live cattle and box beef continues to widen, President Trump is answering the call from the U.S. beef cattle industry to have the U.S. Justice Department look into allegations that U.S. meat processors broke antitrust laws as prices paid to producers have declined even as consumer demand remains strong and meat processors continue to enjoy record profits. I'll ask the Justice Department to look into it. Okay? I've asked them to take a very serious look into it because uh, it shouldn't be happening that way. And we want to protect our farmers. Uh, but they're looking into that very strongly. The president's comments come on the heels of a recent letter to U.S. Attorney General William Barr by several state attorney generals, including Montana's Tim Fox, also requesting an investigation. We need to not only investigate this, but we, I believe, need to trust bust these four large meat packers, and we need to get to a more regional market system where we have processors that are either in Montana or close to Montana. We need to look at having co-ops and, and other ways in which we can market the best beef in the world here from Montana, label it Montana beef, and make sure that our consumers and our producers are protected. And just last month, the Montana Stock Growers Association joined 22 other state cattlemen's associations in also requesting an investigation into beef pricing margins. In Billings, Russell Nimitz, MTN News. Thank you, Russell. And